are you doing? Are we at the doctor's? Yeah. You like the crinkle paper? It's got cool designs on it this time, huh? We're back in the same room. <laughs> All the same. Except you're bigger. Yeah. I'm a big boy. Yeah. I always get in his feet. doctor's office. Gray is up from his nap. He fell asleep on the floor. Lately, Grayson has been sleeping in very weird places. Um, the other day, he took a nap under his bed. He was sleeping in the closet the other night. We came in and had to get him out. He's just kind of funny like that. But Porter survived the doctor. They said he's very healthy. His weight is like 55th percentile his height is like 65th and his head is like 79th he has a huge head <laughs> but they said he looks very healthy um he did get two shots i wonder if you can see i already took the band-aids off yeah you can't even see where he got it but one on each leg poor guy but he's doing a lot better he didn't really take a nap he is teething so bad you guys and he just wants to be held all the time by me, but half the time Listen, me holding him it isn't even isn't even that good. Listen, I've, I've been working on the railroad. Okay. Okay. Gray wants me to sing and draw. This is what I have to do. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. I've been working on the railroad just to pass the time away. Yeah. You sing it. So we made another appointment for two months from now in March for his six month. But for now he's doing good. Yes, Grayson is still wearing his dinosaur boots. And he has now made a mess with all the crayons and thrown them on the ground. And now he can't get his dinosaur boots off. Oh, got one. one two. Get the other one off. One, two. Take your shoe off. One, two. You have no socks on. One, two. So I'm holding Porter now. He got mad because I wasn't holding him. I think he's teething really bad. He's just been really miserable lately, really, really sad. And now he got two shots of the doctor and they give him that liquid, which he did not puke this time. He did puke last time. But he was very sad when he got the vaccine, so I wonder how that's going to add into his mood. But he's just been really sad lately. He's supposed to be done with his developmental leap and in the happy phase, but he is not. He is just constantly upset. See, I'm holding him and he's upset. He's constantly upset and mad. He's cluster feeding. He's eating like crazy. But then he gets mad. I'm still breastfeeding him and he gets mad when my milk doesn't come super fast. So... It's been a little stressful with him. He started to wake up more throughout the night. He wakes up more than once now, usually twice, sometimes three times a night now. So it's just a little difficult with Porter right now. Read the book. Can you read it? Boom, boom, boom. Mr. Brown. Mr. Brown. Mr. Brown makes thunder. Boom, boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Mr. Brown is a wonder. Boom, boom, boom. He can make lightning. <laughs> spot, spot, spot. So lately, Grayson has been really into reading Dr. Seuss books. We have a ton of them, and he thinks they're pretty fun. He was reading it, and then of course I get out the camera, and he stopped. Gray, use your words. So it's the next day. I didn't have much to say yesterday, so I just kind of 
stopped filming and now we're at the next day. I just put Porter down for a nap. He has been so hard to get to sleep lately. Um, I think he's at the part where like he's trying to learn how to fall asleep and it's really hard to figure out I guess. So he cries a lot trying to get to sleep and I have to go in and pick him up and you know rock him a little bit and then I put him back down and then he cries like I used to be able to just like nurse him and then he would sleep and then I would put him in the crib and he would be he would like wake up and startle a little but then he would just fall right back asleep well now I nurse him and then when I put him in the crib he wakes up like completely and he's like freaking out and cries and so I have to let him try to figure it out a little bit and then I go in and soothe him a little and then he has to cry a little more so it's just really been difficult trying to get him to sleep lately but then he takes really good naps it's just i don't know what his deal is and he's still waking up two to three times at night he used to be down to one and then i think he was just trying to trick me he seems fine after the shots he doesn't seem to be acting any differently after that he still seems pretty fussy but i think that's just his teeth Grayson got a new Highlights magazine in the mail. Anthony's grandma got it for him. It's February. Yeah, March. He's very into um, the months of the year right now. Anthony's grandma got him a subscription last year to Highlights magazine. And at the beginning of the year, he didn't really care for them and didn't really understand because he was too young. Now he loves them. He loves, we get them once a month, and he loves them. He likes going through the cartoons. They have Find the Hidden Object. Um, he thinks they're pretty fun. They have stories on them, and he doesn't really care for those. He just flips through them, but he really likes to find the object. So Grayson requested some ice cream. He climbed up into his high chair and said, want an ice cream? I'll input that video I got here. Uh, ice cream? Uh, ice cream? You want ice cream? Okay. Okay. <laughs> so he's doing that. He just randomly asked for ice cream now and then. Gray is jealous. Porter is currently chewing on the Sophie the Giraffe that I got in the mail. And Grayson seems to think that it's his giraffe. Gray, it's Porter's giraffe. He does seem to like it. He's chewing on it pretty well. It's kind of hard to do with one hand, but he does seem to like it. But that makes this boy very jealous because he wants to play with it.